What's up everyone? Welcome back to Whales and Locks. In uh, today's video, we're going to be looking at Georgia at number 16, Tennessee. The line in this game is Tennessee minus 13 and the over-under is 140 and a half. So this is the only time these two teams will match up. This is actually a newly scheduled game as both teams had their previous opponents, uh, their games against previous opponents canceled. Um, so they matched up instead here. Um, on the Georgia side, they sit at 12 and 6, 5 and 6 in the SEC, which puts them at 7th in the conference. Uh, Georgia has a very much flew under the radar this season. Uh, most of that is due to them having quite the cupcake type of schedule so far. Uh, they have yet to play a ranked opponent this entire season. Uh, when I first saw this line, I thought Georgia plus 13 sounded like an absolute lock with a decent record so far, good conference, middle of the pack. And then I looked a little deeper and realized this team really is not that good. Uh, they're ranked 90th in the net, 86th strength of schedule. Um, this team's toughest opponent so far is either likely LSU or Florida, both L's they took there. So after all that, I realized this line probably is exactly what it should be. Uh, Georgia does score, however, 77.7 .7 points per game. Uh, on the Tennessee side, they're sitting at 13-4, and 6-4 and four in the SEC, which puts them in third. Uh, this team certainly likes to have their up and downs this season. Um, they have quality wins against Colorado, Missouri, Kansas, but then they have lost to teams like Ole Miss, and then they did get absolutely rocked by Florida. Um, by 26 points. Uh, one thing that is always consistent, however, with Tennessee is their defense. Uh, they're the number one adjusted defense in the country, according to Ken Palm. And I just think this Tennessee defense is going to suffocate Georgia here in a game that is going to be their most difficult test here for Georgia, especially with it being in Knoxville. This season, Tennessee has held opponents under 61 points in 11 of 17 games this year. I just really like this under 140 and a half here. I can't see Georgia cracking 60 points in a game that I think will be low scoring, try to be controlled tempo here by Tennessee. So I like under 140 and a half. So if you enjoyed this content and would like to see more picks in the future, be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next video.